Husker researchers may turn the tide on a virus capable of causing a pandemic. It's all thanks to a vaccine that could protect pigs and limit the threat to humans. Here's Steve White joining us now live with more. Okay, Steve, are we talking pigs or people? Yeah, really, this has the potential to do some benefit both ways. Mainly, they're trying to protect swine from human viruses, but also protect us from them. Soldiers roll up their sleeves to get their shots. That spread around the world. There was panic. Not COVID, but another outbreak. Relatively easy to forget that we had a swine flu pandemic in 2009. More than 12,000 Americans died. Now Dr. Eric Weaver leads a team at the University of Nebraska giving long-lasting protection. We're now looking into making swine vaccines that not only protect against a broad level of swine influenza, but also human influenza. Weaver calls hogs a mixing vessel where human and bird strains of the flu come together and mutate. So if swine herds can be vaccinated, it could reduce the spread to us. Results are promising. We're expecting to see immunity last for multiple years. While COVID didn't necessarily change their approach, it did drive home the problem with vaccines that wear off quickly. Come on forward. Something Come on. many experienced. Right in. I got vaccinated, I got boosted, and last year I got infected. Weaver doesn't want that to happen here. And their work shows a pig vaccinated at five pounds still has protection at 400 pounds. You imagine such a, a small animal being immunized and, and it grew and the immune response grew with it. Developing the vaccine takes time and they've used that to their advantage, testing it against strains that didn't exist when their work began. It was almost a time travel experiment. And Weaver says it did protect against new strains. They've got more work to do, but repeated results boost confidence it works in pigs. If successful, it could lead to new human flu shots, maybe one given to infants with the potential to last years. And you get boosted again in your 50s. To me, that sounds like a much better plan than going every, in every single year and getting your, your flu shot. So at least for now, when they've gotten that vi vaccine to the pigs, the pigs that have had it, they get healthy, they, they recover from the flu a lot quicker and they get less sick. They're hoping to commercialize this within the next couple of years so that we can keep the pig herds healthy. Steve White, live in Grand Island. Thank you, Steve.